This is a Bobcat S70. There's two different kinds of these. The S70 is the newer version. The 463 is the older version. They're almost identical, or they're exactly really identical. This is the 463. This is an S70. Of course, the call numbers are missing. Both of them are very identical machines. Both of them have this same little guy. And these little guys are equipped with grapplers. Pretty large. The grapplers are pretty large considering. And they're very small to access. When you get in here, very tight fit. Larger individuals will have an issue. These guys will turn on pretty much if you have safety features intact or not. You could have the parking brake off. You could have the seat belts off or the retainer bar off and it'll still turn on no matter what. On your controls up here, you have for your lights, you have your parking brake, and you have an auxiliary power output. You also have warning indicators for hydraulic and for engine. You also have on the ignition, you can turn back the opposite way to prime and heat, heat up the glow plugs. On this side, you have indicators, seat belt, hydraulic lock, parking brake. You also have your voltage indicator on the battery and the temperature switch. On these, the temperature uh, switch, the sensor always gets the one little wire that it has torn off of there. It's a pain in the butt, always. And so anyway, yeah, when you're ready to operate, if you got this guy down, the bar, and uh, the parking brake off, you may have to push this button to unlock them. Well, actually, you gotta put the parking brake off, and you heard the click, and from there, this is pedal function. One side tilt for the bucket. One side is raised for the arms. This is pedal function, so it takes a little bit of getting used to. The throttle accelerator is on the side here. From there, it's basically arm control. Once again, you can start and stop. And yeah, that's your introduction to the Bobcat S70 slash 463.